Hello students, welcome back. The question is from gate 2005 exam and this one is from the topic of CSMACD. So it was for two marks. Just have a look at the statement. They are saying a network with CSMACD protocol in the MAC layer is running at 1 Gbps over a 1 km cable with no repeaters. The signal speed in the cable is 2 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second. The minimum frame size for this network should be. Okay, so have a look. We need to find out the minimum frame size for this network and they are using CSMACD. Now you all very well know that in CSMACD, we want to keep on transmitting for at least 2 into TP time. So transmission time must be greater than twice of propagation delay. Okay. From here we can find out the minimum frame size because TT which is the transmission time is dependent on the frame size. Okay. So TT can be written as L by bandwidth. L is length of packet divided by the bandwidth gives you transmission time and this has to be greater than equal to twice of propagation delay. Propagation delay is also not directly given, but it can be written as distance between the nodes divided by the signal speed. So it is distance divided by the signal speed. Okay, just substitute the values. You can see it will be L is greater than or equal to 2 into distance is given as 1 kilometer. Okay, 1 kilometer. Divided by signal speed is 2 into 10 raised to the power 8 meters per second. So convert kilometers into meter. Okay, first of all, let's convert distance into meters. Because signal speed is also in meters per second. This is 2 into 10 raised to the power 8 meters per second. Okay. And this bandwidth will be multiplied by the right hand side. Okay, so bandwidth given is 1 gigabits per second into 1 giga. Giga means 10 raised to the power 9 bits per second. Okay, whenever we are talking about bandwidth, value of G has to be taken as 10 raised to the power 9. Please don't write 2 raised to the power 30. It's when we are talking with respect to memory. But here we are talking with respect to bandwidth. Okay. So now you can just find the minimum value of L or the frame size. You can see it will be this will be 10 raised to the power 1 because 10 raised to the power 8 will be cancelled with 10 raised to the power 8. Okay. Meter and meter can be cancelled. Per second and per second can be cancelled. So you are left with 1000 into 10 bits. So L is greater than or equal to 10,000 bits. Okay. So the option which is correct is option A which is 10,000 bits. Please don't take option B. Option B says 10,000 bytes. That is incorrect. Okay.